we're going to get on to our next guest this evening. We've got a hangout guest fresh in from Cape Town. Jules, you're going to tell us a little bit about them and get some Irie Cape Town vibes. Yeah, man. Yeah, I know. They, they, they touched base with us a couple of weeks ago, but we're always in Cape Town at the March and Co. There they are. Yeah, Hello. we did. Are we? So, uh, have we got like a... Tomato or something. There they are. Now they can see us now. Okay. All right. Whoa. Ty, can you hear me? Um, who's going to... Stop watching the stream. All right, who's talking to me? Ty. Oh, no. We're in a matrix now. All right. All right, can we have We're some... Good, thanks um, and you. There's a bit of a delay, guys. So keep the question short. Yeah. All right. So now, Ty, can you hear me? It's Jules, yeah? No, all right. Okay. So look at the... Now, let's explain what's going on here. So in the front is um, Ty Platt, and he... He's, he's one of the founders of the Stoner's Guide to Cape Town, which is a private group on Facebook that deals with cannabis culture throughout the Western Cape. And they are in a place called the Society, which is their clubhouse for all things cannabis culture. It is a very, it's a private space, and this is where every now and again they produce a show called The Weed Show. Am I correct? Yes. So, um, are you all funny guys then? <laughs> Would you? Everyone is the funny guy to me. Um, so I do the, I do, I do the jokes instead of comedy. Uh, although I don't stand so much because I'm on YouTube. Now, I don't have time to do that. I'm a pro. Okay. So it's got head down. What's up? Away, away, nice. Ty, Ty, correct me if I'm wrong. Did I see you in Betty Boop when we did uh, the cannabis cup thing? Cannabis cup. Definitely, yeah, definitely. definitely. Yeah, he just comes back from cannabis. I was a judge in the cannabis cup. But yeah, we actually went to have our own Cape Town cup. And I'm actually a judge now. And he said, no master at all. So... There's lots of cups, and I think it's a, a good way forward for the culture. This is the best cup, though. <laughs> <laughs> the chalice. Yes. So tell me, chalice, little, yeah. tell, tell me a little bit about the weed show. So the weed show is basically, it's a 420, I would call it a variety comedy show. Because we have, it's obviously about weed, it's about comedy. You can enjoy your, your weed while you're watching the comedy, but it's also about the message, about the pro cannabis message. We really try to break the stigma, and we also just trying to to kind of break that taboo about cannabis. You know, I mean, trying to desensitize people to it and get them to accept the culture. And we feel that um, humor is a perfect medium. medium. It's a wonderful medium to convey that message across to people. Fantastic. Well, Myrtle and I, Myrtle and I have just come back from Cape Town now. And we were in another. Yeah. We were in another private club on Bree Street. You're in your own private okay. club. We've been to Betty Boop, yeah, yeah. another private yes, club. Sir. So things are starting to cook in Cape Town. Mm, nice. Definitely, definitely. definitely. And we're happy about it. Uh, uh, completely, it's, uh, it's good for the industry. Uh, it may not be good for our banner, our house, or, or us as in a personal business model, but for everyone else in the culture, uh, it's good. And we, uh, the Weed Show, and the society was. Uh, uh, definitely support anyone doing anything that's uh, involving in cannabis in Cape Town. Definitely, because we just do it for the ultimate love of the culture. Fantastic. Where, which suburb are you in? Where, where are you now? Uh, where, 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 where's, uh, where's, where's the, the southern suburbs? Huh? Sorry, Sorry we're in the southern suburbs, close to Kenwood Centre. We're about approximately about two kilometres from Kenwood Centre. Uh, our building has a beautiful view of Cape Town, uh, uh, Table Mountain, the backside of Table Mountain. Um, yeah, so the minute you, the next time you're in Cape Town, please pull into the weed shop, man. We'd love yeah, to, we to, to, we'd love to be honored with your presence. So how, how, how and if anybody wants, we know we get a lot of, you wouldn't believe it, but there's some really isolated stoners out there. They haven't got any friends, and they always come to us on yeah. the back end in Facebook, say, where the fuck is all the culture? Where are all the stoners? 
Send them your boot. Send them your boot. Send them your boot. Send them your boot. We'll host them. We'll host them perfectly. I'm trying to find a link to a, a rapper that sent me a really brilliant tune two days ago, and I want to know if you had heard of him before because he got me going. I retweeted him. We spent the whole day listening to it yesterday. We spent the whole day listening to it yesterday. I've just dropped the link somewhere. Yeah, what's his name? That's exactly what I'm trying to find Very out. Very good question. <laughs> <laughs> because you, you wouldn't believe it, we get pumped full of all sort of stuff. I don't know. I've probably got 40 emails today of just stuff on a web form, just people coming through the website even. Yeah. 40 at least, yeah. yeah at least. So, um, when's the next time that your club is open to the public to come and listen to some comedy? Well, or? Um, tomorrow night we have a weed show, which is basically every Friday night. So, come through. Um, we really, it's meant for our members only, but we welcome people in, we sign them in, we charge them to come in, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, sure. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, but it's a private space, we have to. That's, that's the way we operate. That's the only way we we get away, we fully leave, we don't break any laws of our country. Yeah. We're not the dispensary, we just want to get that clear, you know what I mean? We're not just going to buy the idea. We're, we're not cannabacks, we're not cannabacks. <laughs> we're not the woods, we stop Bring your own, bring your own. Just watch it. Motherfuckers, All right, so uh, let me get this straight. So this is just a social club. There's no, there is no bud tender, there's no sales, nothing. Exactly. Nothing. All right. Exactly. We've, got, we've got 18 cameras. We've got 18 cameras in our establishment to to back up the fact that nobody sells anything over here. Uh, if you get marijuana from everyone, uh, from anyone, it would just be a blessing. But mm. it's never a cash sale. Uh, so we have members coming in, sharing their buds, sharing their dab. Uh, but yeah. nobody's paying for so nothing. No, the buds is flowing. The dabs are flowing. But it's and the love is flowing. The love is flowing. <laughs> we all share. We are one. We are a big family. That that's our our, our modus operandi. We operate like a family. And we, we act like a family. We eat together, we play together, we... Some of us sleep together. Yes, I found the link to the dude who does the rap. The, guy, the guy's called Foreign Roy. Don Stoners. I don't know. So no, I'm gonna, no. um, all right, we'll send him to us. Him to us yeah. We'll host him on our stage, so send him to us, please. I'm gonna send him the. I'm gonna send you the link tie to his tune because it's a really it cool. Really any any artist in Cape Town is welcome yeah. to, uh, to come to our stage. You just need to have a little bit of talent, and you must have the love for marijuana. It's like your your right to admission. If you don't like marijuana, don't come to our club. Uh, no place for you. Yeah, yeah. It's like, yeah. The devil is not welcome here. Yeah. 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 You're gonna make them do pee tests at the door. You must be this high to enter. <laughs> <laughs> That's brilliant. So, do you guys think weed is a performance in answer? Do we think weed is a performance in answer? Oh no, um, uh, uh, weed is definitely a performance in answering drug. Yeah. If you're going to a hot dog eating competition, <laughs> I, <will Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's a six in answering drug. Yeah. 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 That's really funny. All right, listen, guys. Um, we're gonna get. We're gonna go back into the studio now and get onto the next leg because we're on a time constraint. It's really hilarious listening to you. We're any. We've got all of your links to all of your pages. I hope you get somebody to come through the door tomorrow to say we saw you guys on the hot box. And the next time we're all together in Cape Town, which is, it, it won't be long. Let's see if we can do a hook up and a live stream from the weed show. Yes. Definitely, yeah. We'll film an nice. episode Thank of you so much for your honor, much respect. All right, much man. Love, much love. Listen, listen in. We'll hear you in the background. All right. Oh, we're chess guys. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> okay, that was hilarious. Yes, yeah, so it's hot dog eating competition. So, uh, folks, we've put the links down in, down in the description. Please go check them out. Um, Irie guys from Cape Town, Irie Vibes. Personally, I can say I grew up a little bit there, Kenwood, Kenilworth side. Know that hood. Um, yeah, lots of tight communities there. Very tight communities. It's it's great to see this happening because also, from what I remember, that was also a conservative-ish community. Mm -hmm. You know, there were a lot of aunties there that would be like, mm -mm, not for my boy, not for my girl. So that that's even happening there in Cape Town is a good thing. It's wonderful. 
Oh, yeah. Right, there's more cups open. Really, it's going to But that's really just uh, basically a drug consumption room. There is no, there's no uh, first one we've heard like that, perhaps. Yes. Where yeah, it's where just a, like a, the, the community club, basically. It could be the local gym or the bowls club or something or other. Same thing. It's just. <laughs>